Terrific fashion. I'll go to the restroom and hope that when I come back, it's my shot. Five ball in the corner pocket. Nine the next is ball will be the one. He, the nine went on the break. He made three balls on the break. Had he not made the nine, he would not have had a shot. Hey, and he'll probably <laughs> stop Whitey behind the four ball. Real he, first. He might be able to make this ball. Oh, he could make it. Oh, I'm blind. Did that look to you like he could make that? I've known that for a long time. Kamusta mga kaibigan? Isang dominanteng laban na naman ng The Magician ang babalikan natin. Ito ang 1997 US 9-Ball Tour na ginanap sa Virginia, USA. Ang mga kalaban ng The Magician dito ay ang pambato ng Japan. Ang sharpshooter na si Kunihiko Takahashi na kilala din sa bansag na sniper. Si Takahashi ay world champion din ng 9-Ball mga idol. Nakuha niya ang titulo ng matalo niya si Johnny Archer. Pero sa laban na ito, ang mga katapat niya ay si Efren Bata Reyes. Kayaning kaya niya ang The Magician? Sniper pa rin kaya siya pag-uwi o espada na lang ang hawak niya pagkatapos ng laban? Yan ang titignan natin sa video na ito. Simulan na natin to mga idol. Ito ang match sa 1997 US 9-Ball Tour, Efren vs. Takahashi, Race to 11. Unang sargon the magician. Pasok ang uno sa side pocket. Ang lakas pa rin talaga ng sargon ni Efren nung araw. Tignan natin kung maubos ni Efren ang mga bola sa unang rack. Break is improved. And Efren has been the greatest player in the world, and perhaps the greatest player to have ever played the game. Now he's asserted himself, and he's unarguably the greatest player in the world. But not until last year here at the U.S. Sa larong ito pala mga idol ay 43 years old si Efren. Si Takahashi naman ay 28 years old. Play, so that uh, kind of like tells you how well this man. I got no reason to try to play for the combination here. And you couldn't place it any better with your hand. And he can uh, just come out one natural rail here. Or he can spin over with a lot of inside English and play the eight up the long rail. That's probably Ang gandang cue control noon. Perfect position para sa ocho. And just like that, in just a moment, it's going to be one to nothing advantage Efren Reyes. We are, of course, in Chesapeake, Virginia. And I love this At nakuha ni Efren ang unang rock. Especially this time of year. Both Jimmy Wedge and Jimmy Rippey played extremely well in that match. I'm not going to tell you who won that match, but to check it out. Well, it's Second rock break ni Efren. Pasok na naman ang uno sa side pocket. On a two ball, to shoot that from long range, it's eminently miserable. Mukhang open table na naman ito para kay Efren ah. Abangan natin ang diskarte niya. Rather than playing for the side pocket, that's the right shot. Reason for him to do that, if the balls as they lie sit perfectly. Right, he has a, had a perfect angle. I kind of like this. Sa taong ito mga idol, ay tinuturing na ng marami na si Efren Reyes ang the greatest player of all time. Dahil ilang taon bago ang laban na ito, ay nagtala na ng maraming world title si Efren at nagawa na din niya ang Z-shot ng kalabanin niya si Earl Strickland sa San Jose Regency. Efren Reyes has not only tremendous control of the cue ball and, and controls the speed ball in terms of speed, uh, controls the cue ball in terms of speed, any better than the man at the table now. Well, it didn't take... And this is one of those shots, but... We have a bridge and... Swabbing rock para sa The Magician. 2-0 na ang score. It's gonna be formidable. Third rock. Sargo na naman ang The Magician. No reason to change the break position. I heard a ball drop. I believe it was the one in the side. Ayun na naman. Pasok ulit ng uno sa side pocket. Halos nasa kanan lahat ng bola. Mukhang sisiw na naman kay Efren ng rock na ito ah. Sa tournament na ito ay kalahok din si Strickland. 
at ng isang Pinoy billiard legend na si Parika. How we envision things happening the correct way, well, that's how he played. And respecters of knowledge, anyway. And certainly he is the embodiment of uh, knowledge and professionalism. Plus he's a classy guy too. I think he's a neat guy. He's a... Hanggang ngayon, hindi pa rin natayo si Takahashi ah. Pagod na ang bangko ng hapon, mga idol. And all of that notwithstanding, his favorite meal is rice. A dog and a couple <laughs> bowls of rice and... Uh, <laughs> I mean, he'll sit down and watch movies for like 30 hours straight on TV. I mean, what a great guy to have on the road. It's inexpensive and he beats everybody he plays. Exactly, and game number... At naubos ulit ni Efren ng bola sa rack na ito. 3-0 na ang score. Three games to nothing at one, wouldn't you think? <laughs> Astronomical about like, the, is the sun going to come up tomorrow? Two more, two... Fourth track, hulog ang dalawang bola sa side pocket at corner pocket. Tingnan natin ang diskarte ni Efren sa dos. Ang gandang positional shot noon para sa tres. Open table na to para kay Efren. Well, to Takahashi's credit, he hasn't made any mistakes save losing the leg. Now, in case you people are routine, but what he is doing out there is... Just a little bit short of miraculous. He's just playing perfect position, no matter what type of an angle or shot. Well, it's beautiful to witness. I'm forced to admit. Of course, uh, Takahashi may have a slightly different view. Oh, he is a perfect gentleman too. One of the things I like about him, uh, up at the new Bedford player from Japan, he engaged in some interesting. After hours matches against some of the best players in the world and perfect gentlemen to play with and bet respectable sums of money and I like that kind of thing. Well, four to nothing. Four zero na, ganun ganun lang. Pakitingin nga mga idol, baka nakatulog na si Takahashi. This Billy, when my opponent starts off in, in such terrific fashion, I'll go to the restroom and hope that when I come back, it's my shot. Five. Fifth track, sargo ulit ni Efren. Ayun na. Mas pinapadali ata ni Efren ang buhay ni Takahashi ah. Hulog na ang 9. 5-0 na ang score. Six rack ang gandang break ni Efren. Hulog ulit ang uno sa side pocket. Kaso nakatago ang dos, dikit ang cue sa 9. Nag-push Efren sa wakas, nakatayo din si Takahashi. Oh, look at this. May tira din talaga si Takahashi. Ang gandang bank shot nun. Makahabol pa kaya siya? Tingnan natin. A little bit of right English. Don't want to hit this very hard. Cue ball will slide up naturally for the four ball. So the barrage that Ray has put on Takahashi most certainly didn't, uh, you know, impair his judgment. He plays a great game of safety too. I was surprised by that. I don't know where he learned it, but... He certainly came to the United States with it. That's a beautiful shot from where he was. Come beneath the sixth. Well, plus the si Takahashi pala ay nagsimula magbilyar sa edad na 17 years old at nagawang mag-world champion sa edad na 28 years old. May tira din talaga ang hapon na ito, mga idol. That's exactly what he needed to do. I don't know if he has room. I do believe he does have room. Well, this is going to be a pretty impressive run out here. I mean, under the conditions. Oh, you can tell it's inevitable that you'll join me very, very soon after you enter. <laughs> <laughs> so, I, I can't argue with I'm really impressed with, the, with not only his ability to play the game, but with his, you know, his fortitude, his guts. Sure, and I think this knowledgeable U.S. Open audience was extremely difficult considering the circumstances. Nice shot, nice out. At nakuha ni Takahashi ang rack 6, 
five one on score. Number six, that's a big game right there. That certainly sends them. It takes more to bring out fear and stuff. Seven track, unang sargo ng Japanese player. Does that explain your inability to defeat a skilled opponent, fear? That is a big factor. Look at this. He stopped the cue ball in the middle of the table. And didn't come up with the shot. And to make it worse, the six ball brushed the cue ball back. Ang ganda ng sargo. Kaso ang hirap ng posisyon ng uno. He's using the left side of the one ball to come off of him. And a little more high risk than using the right side of the one ball. So therefore, cue ball control here is definitely imperative. Ayun lang. Parang binigay lang kay Efren ng bola. Open table pa naman. Mukhang malilinis ni Efren ng lamesa sa rack na ito ah. This is really easy stuff right now for Reyes. Well, I think he might have been better advised to take a little extra time on that critical safety play. Now he can just punch this over one natural rail. And that's perfect. Above the six. A little bit of low left English, exactly like that. Just below center ball, some left English. Like that. Back up by the side pocket, a little right English, and then towards the nine again off the second rail, just exactly like that. He's playing the game. Just punch this in, just below center ball, and six to one. Our Kay Efren ang lak seven, six one ang score. Our viewers on some of the other score. One ball on the side. Now Reyes is making the one ball on the side. Eight track. Pasok na naman ng uno sa side pocket sa sargo ni Efren. Kaso, dikit ang 3 at 4. Ano kaya discard ni Efren dito? Suabe team cut sa 3. Ginawang simple ni Efren ang tira na yun. Okay. But he's at the table, and when you saw him position the cue ball in a curious position, which you thought was a curious position, you should have known at that time that he could have made the three. True. Looks well, like he's going to opt to play the seven-nine combination. That's what lies right near the side pocket, and really not having to do too much with the cue ball after pocketing the seven. But uh, nevertheless, he's going to be able to put this in also. At ayun, combination shot sa 7 at 9, 7-1 ang score. He's played a flawless match. Diretso na tayo sa 9 track. Sargo na naman ng The Magician. And as we've grown to expect, there are always great matches. Pumasok ang uno, kaso sumunod ang cue ball, naingit sa uno. For some reason, you know, the cue ball just have a has a tendency to go toward the... Pagkakataon na ni Takahashi, kaso malayo-layo pa ang hahabulin niya. He trails by the score of one game to seven. Has an opportunity to narrow the gap somewhat here. And like a slight angle. And uh, he can play position on the eight in the side pocket. Look at this. Ooh. That, that's not what he meant to do, I don't think. He probably won't. The cue ball wasn't able to find its way in back of the five. But uh, he's still in line despite that little... Uh... Well, he's got to be careful when he goes from the five. Oh, this is a perfect angle. Now he will uh, obtain position on the seven ball. That's couldn't place it with your hand any better than that. I just go beyond the side, draw the ball beyond the side, so they're taking the side pocket totally out of the picture. I don't like. Yun lang sumablay siya sa saiz. Nangalay na ata siya sa kakaupo, mga idol. Si Efren ang babanat. Kaso, tago ang 7 sa 9. Tignan natin ang gagawin ni Efren dito. Efren will go 3 rail. Nice natural angle. Ang gandang posisyon nun para sa 7. 2 rails with a little inside English. Like that. Grabing English cue control nun, mga idol to practice playing nine ball because notice the position of the cue ball now. If you would have uh, attempted that... Parang ang simple lang kay Efren ng mga tira, no? Ibang klase talaga. Cushion. But if you can uh, perfect that shot, you're going to find yourself always in line. 
Nakuha ni Efrain ang Rack 9. Tenk Rack, hulog na naman ng uno. Buhay na si Efren sa mga sargo niya sa laro na to ah. Kaso, medyo dikit-dikit ang mga bola sa left side ng lamesa. Gising pa ba kayo dyan? Kung gising pa kayo, eh, pakilike naman ang video at pakomment na din sa baba para mabasa natin sa comment section. Salamat, mga idol. His fine judgment on how to play position and his fine cue ball speed, which has eluded him on that particular shot. He's very limber. He can he stretches over the table quite easily. This is rack number 10, and with the pocketing of the nine, Reyes will then have a very commanding lead of nine games to one. At nakuha ni Efren ang Rock 10, 9-1 ang score. Eleven track, sargo ulit ni Efren. Hulog na naman ang uno sa side pocket at isang bola sa corner pocket. Buenas talaga si Efren sa mga sargo niya dito. You know, something that, uh, that we really don't get to see that often. And I've always said this, and I'm going to say it again. It really has been a privilege for me to be here on earth while this man is here also. Because uh, well, I've heard stories it. about players like uh, Ralph Greenleaf and Willie Moscone and players like that. I've really never had... Mukhang natroma ang hapon sa laban na to, mga idol. Pero malamang ay natuto si Takahashi dito. ...to watch play, and it's certainly a, really a treat for me. Oh, it is for everybody. No question about it. And I learned something often watching one of Efren's matches. From Manila. Well, he's still in the tournament. Takahashi is going to still be in the tournament once this match is over with. But everybody asked me why I like single elimination. At ni ang rock 11. And I'm going to tell you why. All right. If I play in a tournament in Trickland and CJ... 12 rock, sargo ni Efren. Pusibling huling rock ng laban. Pasok ang 4 sa corner pocket. Medyo mahirap ang posisyon ng bola. Tingnan natin ang diskarte ng The Magician. Nabreak ang bola, kaso medyo dumikit ang 5 sa cushion. That's perfect. Just pull this back and play the five in the same corner. Seven ball cross table from the five with the same angle. This play, this shot plays a little tougher. Once again, he illustrates. Ang ganda ng tira. Inagaw ng simple ni Efren na mga ganon tira. The follow shot. By doing that, they they really decrease the size of the pocket. With the speed that he hit that shot with, he actually allowed the pocket to play as over with. So, it certainly is over, and it didn't take much time because the man at the table saw to that, playing just about as We're perfect do an nine interview ball too. which you could possibly. Efren's been working on his English, you know, for a while when we were doing. At nakuha ni Efren ng laban, napakamot na lang sa ulo si Takahashi. Eh. Ibang klase talaga si Efren, mga idol.
So we'll have him up here in, in, in just a minute. 